Harry Dowling and I'm a surf life saving cadet leader. My name is Cadet Leader Officer David Jones. I'm the adjutant at Christchurch Grammar School Cadet. My name is Max Griffler. Uh, my name is Tan Susan Brown and I'm a Year 11 NCOM leader. Hi, my name is Rohan Wang. Uh, my name is Brandon Dale. Hi, my name is Lucas Small and I'm the 2020 Service Prefect at Christchurch Grammar School. I instruct and guide the younger year 10s. I'm taking PE, I do art with them, I cook. I go around to different aged care facilities and helping them with chores. Veggie and fruit boxes, um, up to 16 kilos, and pack them all so that a company called Second Bike can come and pick them up. Coordinate and assist the service activities within the school. There's about seven or eight that I uh, manage along with the teaching staff. Four day camp for disabled kids over the summer holidays. We take uh, around 20 or 30 disabled kids into the Walters boarding house. Navigation through first aid, through a drill. It's training as a whole with sort of a military focus. Developing our skills, learning new things, and just sort of giving back to those who have helped us before. I just want to give back to the school really, because I'm a lifer. I give back to the community that has adopted me so well into it, being not originally from Perth. I thought it'd be a fun way to try something new. I'm helping people and I personally like to get involved in my community. Personally considering a career in the Defence Force, and I thought this would be an excellent route for me. Developing our skills, learning new things, and just sort of giving back to those who have helped us before. Being able to know that I'm having an impact on my community and knowing that I'm uh, helping these people and that's unique throughout the school. I'm directly responsible for all 66 boys. Why not give them a helping hand, you know, and you get to make new friendships, you get to... It's, a, it's an opportunity that's pretty much unparalleled. Definitely step out of your comfort zone. Um, I think the more you put into these opportunities, the more you get out of it as well. I'd say if you're considering it, then just give it a go. If you want to do something that you haven't done before, you know, get out of your comfort zone. You'll learn new things, you'll develop skills. It doesn't particularly matter the way in which you do it. What matters is that you get out there and try.